Hey friends, welcome to the channel Health Tricks and Tips in English, the best pregnancy centric channel. So in this video, I will tell you some of the measures that you need to take when the sugar level in your blood increases during pregnancy. That is you are suffering from gestational diabetes or the chances are there. So you need to alter your diet in some of the ways. So number one thing is that you need to include more of the probiotics in your diet. Probiotics actually helps in the digestion of the food and these are actually the good bacteria that you can get from a lot of food items and it will help you in maintaining the carbohydrate level they will increase the metabolism and it will control the sugar level in the blood the best way to get the probiotic is to eat probiotic curd in your diet number second thing you can do to reduce the level of sugar is to include more of the proteins now protein you can get from the dry foods like almond walnuts and also there is ample of protein in eggs that you should preferably be eating only the boiled one apart from this if you are non-vegetarian then meat is also a good option but always make it sure that the meat is not raw it should be properly cooked before you consume it so the protein is also very much helpful in regulating the blood sugar number third thing you should do is to include the high fiber diet so you should include the things that is having both type of fiber that is the soluble fiber and the insoluble fiber because the insoluble fiber will help you in boosting your digestive system whereas the soluble fiber will be helping you in maintaining the sugar level in the body there are a lot of food you can include for the fiber content that is oats you can include or the beans you can include in your diet also the whole grain is also a good option or the sprouts you can include that will give you ample of insoluble fiber and the soluble fiber our fourth thing is to understand whatever you are eating should have a proper glycemic index the glycemic index of the food you are eating should not be high it should be always low that is known as a low glycemic index so i have already told you some of the things but here you can also go for the whole grains beans oats vegetable you should include lots of fruits in your diet they are very very good and they are having low glycemic index this will boost up your digestion and it will help you in reducing the blood sugar level in the body so friends the problem of gestational diabetes is really not good for you because it can lead to various problem it can cause the unwanted weight gain for you and the baby's weight gain can also be hampered the baby's weight can go down and this is not a welcoming situation you can have lots of problems like nausea and the morning sickness because if the blood sugar level is going up in your body then you may face the problem of nausea and vomiting also it has been observed that if you are consuming more of the sugar then the baby is more prone to have the heart related disorders and these signs are quite visible when the baby is over and above the age of 7 years. So friend you need to check the level of sugar in your body. Your blood sugar should not go high and for this you have to take all the measures that I have told you. This was all in this video friends. Hope you have liked this small information. If you like it kindly press the like button. If you are new to the channel do not forget to subscribe to the channel. And also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos on pregnancy. Let's meet up in another video on pregnancy. Till then stay happy, stay healthy.